So a lot of you don't know me. I'm kind of hidden away from everyone in my devil's lair, I call it. My private facility in Panama City, Florida. And I do that intentionally because I want everyone to feel comfortable and welcome and uh, just positive and feel like when you walk in that you have uh, the abilities to uh, be educated, inspired, and motivated to become a better person, not only mentally, physically, and nutritionally. And that's what I do. I'm going to give you a very personal story about me real quickly. A lot of things you guys don't know about, so it's going to get real uncomfortable for a second. And then you're going to understand me much better. I'm going to stand on my ex, right? Okay. I am a 46-year-old woman. I'm a mother of three beautiful daughters, all grown, and three grandmothers. I've been divorced six years. I'm a single girl. I started my business 13 years ago. But at the age of 26, I was told that I had cancer. And as a young mother, that is very scary. I will not go into the details of what it was or how, but from the age of 26 to 33, I underwent five major surgeries and a lot of tests to figure out what in the world is wrong with me. I had a major stroke, lost the side of this eye and this arm. I'm left-handed, holding this microphone in my left hand. Was told I can't put my arms over my head. Woohoo! I do it all day, every day and I love it. Um, so at the age of 33, I had my last surgery that was 2002. And I was told by my cancer specialist, don't ever come back in here, I don't wanna see you again. Well, that was the best news ever. So I had three months to decide what I wanna do with my life. My background is restaurant, condo, and hotel management. I work with Hilton Sandestin. And of course, I had my corporate job waiting for me. And I've been a corporate girl since I can remember. So going back into my job and thinking about what I wanted to do with my life, I wanted to understand why I got sick. There has never been cancer on either side of my family, and we don't want it to continue on into any other sides of our family. We wanted to stop here. So what do we do? Do you guys know that 50% of all cancer can be cured or healed just by changing what you eat? Just by what you eat alone? So, over the past 13 years, now I'm 46, I have taken a holistic approach in education. I have hired the best fitness experts. I have worked with 10 doctors and two dietitians to educate myself, no matter what it is and knowledge, so that I can therefore help you so you don't have to go through these issues. Yes, I went through this for you. So when you come into my facility and you don't know what to do, you don't know how to help yourself, where to start, that's what we do. We can help you. If there is, there is not anything that you have gone through, we can't help you with. Just by just putting our hand on your back and saying, I got you, we can help you. What is it that you want? Decide what it is that you want. When you know what you want or what your problem is, we can find the solution. If you don't know, we'll help you find it. But come to us, let us help you. Don't be afraid, it's a private environment. No one will know that you are there. The doors are locked behind you. It is us one-on-one, -on -one just talking and listening and helping you. And that's what we do. The Fit Devil was created by a client who called me the devil. And that can be my gentle yet firm demeanor when I'm training or working with my clients. And it's out of love and kindness, but you told me what you wanted, right? So as your accountability partner, I wanna make sure that you get that. So I'm going to hold you accountable. So sometimes I get a little hard on you, I push you, but it's what you want, it's what you need. And when you're finished and you've reached your maintenance goal or whatever level that you're at, and you're standing there and you're going, wow, I can't believe I did it. We can go, yes, you can. You did it, here we are. The education that you will receive through our facility will last your lifetime. It's like the end all be all from everything you've ever been through. So whatever diet, or prescription drugs or anything you've ever been on to get yourself healthy and well, get rid of them. They don't belong inside your body. They're just chemicals that over time are going to wreak havoc on your body, okay? Please stop and think about what you put inside you. What you put into your body today will show up on you 10 years later. Thank you so much.